Hello everyone. In this video we're going to be looking at uh, a discordant coast and we're also going to be looking at the types of features that form on it which are headlands and bays. So again in this diagram please remember that we're looking at this from a top-down perspective that means we're flying over uh, the coastline looking down on it. Now a discordant coast uh, means specifically that the rocks are layered in discord. That means that they're not the same. So we have this alternative layering of rock. So we have hard, soft, hard, soft, and hard again. And what that's going to mean is that when the sea comes to uh, impact and to erode this coastline, you'll find that the hard rock erodes much slower than the soft rock erodes. That means that we're going to have a discordant shape. It's not going to be a regular shape. So as you can see in this diagram, um, the sea and the sea's waves will come in and they will hit the coast uh, and um, what they will do is they will impact the coast in a different way. So in the second diagram over, sea, uh, over here, sorry, you can see that I'm drawing uh, the new shape of the coast after many, many years of erosion. The soft rock has now moved inwards or has been eroded much faster and the hard rock has also been eroded which has softened the edges or rounded them. The hard rock layers, as you can see over here, these are going to be the layers of headland. And the green, uh, the soft rock layers, these are going to be the areas of uh, the bays. And you can see that also inside of the bays, a typical formation is um, beaches that form inside bays because they tend to trap sediment through longshore drift that we've looked at in a previous video. Now in real life, this is what uh, a discordant coastland would look like. Look like. This is specifically a New Zealand coastline. And you can see that we have the headlands and bays uh, that form. And if we were to add, uh, like we are just now, the kind of hard rock and the soft rock, soft rock layers, you'll find that it has the, the very regular shape. And you can see directly inside of the bays that you've got the beaches that form. This is just an example of a real life one. Thank you very much for watching and have a really good day.